The fire happened on December the 6th of 2011. I received a phone call from the monitoring company that the fire alarm was going off, and we've never had the fire alarm going off, so I was definitely concerned about that. I jumped in my car, and by the time I got here, fire had already been extinguished, and I was more concerned about the original objects that were in the house. I saw that the front porch areas was definitely had fire damage. The next day, when we really got into it, started to assess what needed to be done, and then also um, Belfour basically started telling me all of the things that we needed to do to mitigate the damage to the house. Initially, after we arrived and did our initial assessment, uh, we had to first think of the objects in the house and uh, kind of contain and environmentally stabilize uh, the conditions in the house. They isolated every room, brought in air handlers, air scrubbers, dehumidifiers, all of this type of thing. And that's something that just sort of blew my mind that it was that extensive. And yet they had it here uh, practically instantaneously. From there, we, we turned to the assessment of the objects in the house, the antique furnishings, and things like the wallpaper and the art. Some of the most challenging parts of this project were the long lead items. Uh, we have wool loom carpet from England, from two different mills. We have uh, Irish lace draperies that had to be produced. I would recommend Balfour because I think they had an understanding of what really needed to be done. I think they had an understanding of the scope of the project. I don't think we could have done the quality restoration that we did without their help. I think this project was unique because of there were so many moving parts. This is a dearly held uh, property in the city of Modesto and uh, it's it brought the community out of the woodwork really to, to be involved with the restoration project. The community um, recognizes the importance of the house. It's been referred to as the jewel of Modesto, and I think that's how people look at it. Towards the end, we had like a sea of little heads from the school buses that were emptying out of the place to do the school tours, and uh, to see the kids just be so interested and so well behaved and really treat this place with the reverence that it deserved, that's what makes this property really special. And I think myself being a representative of Belfour and the, and the support I had from my team and uh, the personnel and everybody that showed up on site. It, it, it rang true for everybody here how important this property was to the community. My first love has always been the mansion and it means a whole lot to me and basically my life's work.